Bend your eyes. Start thinking. Go and start leafing the pages of that book of history. Read the faces of those who lived in the shackles. In the shackle of lawlessness, injustice, cruelty, and violence. Your Honor, it is time to break free from the shackles of slavery. Be that mind or wisdom. Be that body or soul. Be that pen or speech. Your Honor, think of that slavery which compelled the great leaders of the nation to come forward and consequently killed, butchered, slaughtered and executed. Think of that slavery which took mother, father, brother and sister of thousands of people. Think of that slavery which passed thorns in the way of shakers of slavery. Think of that slavery which is exiled, unemployed, and murdered countless of humans. Ladies and gentlemen, think of the 73 years of the so-called freedom and independence in which we just learned. No coordination, no cooperation, no congregation, no qualification, no education, no legislation, no administration. We just learned. Assassination. Humiliations, relaxations, celebrations, and congratulations, and welcome to Pakistan. Ladies and gentlemen, throughout the 73 years of the freedom and independence, I haven't seen a ray of freedom of war. We have always been taken into the layers of giving us the lullaby of getting freedom, just in the form of money. Some other times in the shape of foodstuff. Ladies and gentlemen, how can I call it freedom? How can I call it freedom when Nakibullah is killed by the state and his father is killed, stands with stare? How can I call it freedom when Nakibullah is killed by the state and his father is ordered to stand with stare? How can I? How can I call it freedom when Salahuddin is killed by the state and his father is ordered to stand with state? How can I, Mr. President, how can I call it freedom when metric pass minister is elected and intellects are rejected? How can I call it freedom? How can I call it freedom when the news and concerns are filled with blood? The blood of LPS Peshawar, the blood of Lal Masjid, the blood of suicide attacks in every city of the state. How can I call it freedom? How can I call it freedom, Mr. President, when the mothers of Kashmiris are killed, slaughtered and butchered and they are crying for help but nobody is there to help them. We are just helping them with songs, dramas and speeches. How can I call it freedom? Your Honor, it is time to break free from the shackles of slavery. Let's stand together, clap, and admire the 73 years of achievements and learn from our failures. Your Honor, it is time to be united, stand together, look back, and start struggling for the free and brighter Pakistan. I thank you all.